Having the vaccine and understanding the effectiveness of the vaccine. Now we have a new guest in studio, Ilan Bublil, Director of Marketing, a supporting key strategic and innovative programs at IAI Elta Systems. He's a seasoned executive with more than 20 years of experience in international sales and marketing in the high-tech market. He heads IAI Elta Systems Marketing and with sales over $1.5 billion annually, it is huge. IAI Elta Systems, a group and subsidiary of Israel Aerospace Industries, is one of Israel's leading defense and technology companies. Let's watch a short video presentation about it. It's a non-contact computerized machine that can detect if someone has COVID-19 by using wow. military grade radar. Mr. Bublil, thank you for being with us. Thank you, pleasure. Wonderful presentation. Thank you. Now we just want to know a little bit more about IAI Systems, Elta Systems. Sure. So first of all, I'm very happy to be here. Thank you. Uh, Elta is a group and subsidiary of IAI. IAI is the largest defense company in Israel and one of the world leading uh, defense supplier in the world. So uh, in Elta, Actually, we are specializing in defense, innovative uh, solutions. Uh, we are, as, as you mentioned earlier, we are export of $1.5 billion of, of systems. We have almost uh, 4,000 employees, most of them scientists and engineers. Um, we are working in the many domains such as uh, space, air, land, sea, cyber, intelligence. And recently, we're going into the medical and uh, life-saving uh, situations head by a VP uh, or CTO, actually, uh, Mr. Israel Lupa. Unbelievable. So it's a huge job. How is IAI Elta engaged with the life-saving innovation technology market? Medical okay. market, I should say. Sure. I, I think this, the, uh, the question and the answer, I, my, my own uh, actually uh, belief is going to change the history. On the one hand, you know, Elta and the defense market have amazing technologies. Uh, for instance, Elta has been there for a decade, okay? And we have amazing technology, amazing uh, scientists. And on the other hand, the medical field 
has amazing sightings also, and both have very similar verticals. Now, if you look in the medical field, you can see that from our observation uh, that it's lacking a lot of technologies that can help the patients. Uh, for example, uh, sensing uh, information without actually uh, contact. The recent uh, pandemic, uh, when the crisis started, the Minister of Health and the Minister of Defense in Israel approached Elta and asked, can we do something? Can we help protect the, 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 the medical teams? Because uh, thousands of medical uh, health workers get infected by COVID-19. So what we did, we took the defense technology and teach it, convert, convert it to be a, a life-saving sa uh, situation. And actually our system, one of the system uh, named uh, Tamar, is now can read the vital signs of a human person from a distance. Not having a person connected with all the wires and connection and, and, and not, not the need to, to, to actually touch a person to make a, a, a test. And this, this uh, system is really revolution. And that's the reason I'm saying history change because you can see that you take a medical uh, need and have a defense solution come into it. For example, you know, Israel is known as the startup nation. And as a startup nation, they have thousands and thousands of amazing startup companies. Some of them have 10 people. Some of them have 100 uh, employees. In Elta, we have over 4,000 employees. And the R&D that we invest over the years of billions of dollars, if we take that, so a project to help the medical field, which was uh, before took about four to five years, the Tamar came in 12 months. So this is the breakthrough. I think we're going to hear much more about how the defense market entering to the medical field. Actually, in the world, it's very known that uh, this, uh, this two arena are getting close to each other. And I'm, I'm very happy to, that the ELTA is taking part of it. And I'm sure that they're happy to have you working on it as well. I hope so. <laughs> what is the status right now of this life-saving system? Sure. So right now we are under a clinical test, very advanced uh, stage in three hospitals in Israel. Uh, we, again, by a uh, Minister of Defense and Minister of Health. And we actually in uh, more than 70 percent almost done with this test. And uh, what's amazing, this is another amazing, and as I said, the history change. You take this medical device, for instance, the Tamar, and you find that it's accurate at the minimum, same as the medical equipment that is part of the taking part in the hospital. So you have a medical equipment in the hospital, and then you find that the, the, the medical, I would say the defense grade system is accurate the same or a little bit more. And this, again, with non-contact, with not having people part of the COVID-19, you have to maintain distance. And this is the amazing uh, part of it. So soon, I think we, once we're gonna, uh, we're gonna be done with this, uh, uh, this, this uh, clinical test, we will be ready for uh, selling to, to the, all the, the health system. Again, it's very, uh, very promising because the results are amazing. Wow, that is very interesting. Do you have any additional examples that you'd like to share with us about ELTA's activity in the medical technology arena? Sure. You know, the list is very long. As you saw in the movie, we signed con uh, some agreement with Soroka and uh, with hospitals, and, and we have other uh, agreements. Basically, um, we have the CoronaNet. The CoronaNet is a, a secure system that uh, many doctors around the world can, can uh, communicate each other during the COVID-19 and uh, in exchange information uh, and cyber with cyber protection and all so forth. We have uh, many other uh, solutions, patent solutions, and I think the world uh, soon will be uh, exposed to them once they'll be ready to be published. Unbelievable work. We're very excited to see what's happening next. Mr. Ilan Bublil Todaraba, thank you very much for thank being so with much. us from IAI Elta, and we're happy to have you in studio today. Thank you. Same here. Thank you.
All right, well, that is it for Improvate's Life Saving Technologies Conference. We've looked today into the fascinating future of medicine, and we've heard from top experts throughout Israel and Europe, and from leading Israeli technology companies. Improvate is all about access and connections, exposing Israeli tech to leaders in governments and companies around the world to promote business whose goal is innovation. The exposure right here at this conference is a first step. The next step, maybe? Delegations and real world business connections are next. We want to thank you all for taking part, and we hope that this is just the start of doing business together, making technology accessible to all, and improving the lives of people across the world. That's it for now. I'm Shanna Fold. Thanks so much for joining with us.